And on the eighth day, God looked down on the adolescent world and said, I need a messenger. So God made a young life leader. God said, I need somebody willing to go where the kids are, to enter their world and to get to know them on their turf, someone who will love them enough to tell them about Jesus and keep loving them no matter what they believe. So God made a young life leader. I need somebody brave enough to start a conversation from scratch, but who will talk to me about kids before they ever talk to kids about me. Somebody to remember names, to walk the halls of school, silently praying to pursue teenagers with my love. So God made a young life leader. God said, I need somebody who will make themselves available, even when it's not convenient. Someone who will sit in the student section at a football game, get pied in the face, stay up late talking about life, make pancakes before school, get stood up for lunch, ask good questions, listen without judgment, love without condition. I need somebody willing to step out of the comfort of their own life and into the foreign culture of adolescence. Somebody willing to follow me on this narrow path of self-sacrifice, rejection, and discomfort so that teenagers can see me with skin on. So God made a young life leader. God said, I need somebody willing to take time off work to spend a week with kids at camp, go nonstop, lose their voice singing at the top of their lungs, sleep on the floor mattress in a cabin, pray over every kid, and talk one-on-one -on -one about what their creator thinks about them. So God made a young life leader. God said, I need somebody that will take the time to earn the right to be heard, somebody who believes that relationships are of the highest value, who will do whatever it takes to build bridges of friendship, who believe that it is a sin to bore a kid with the gospel. Somebody to pray, sweat, cry, dream, pursue, believe, show up, pray more, share, encourage, serve, and love in the hope that they would reach the furthest out kids and all the ones in between. Somebody who also believes in the big dream, that everyone deserves a chance to hear about Jesus Christ. Somebody who would continue to love the lost, no matter their response. So, God made a young life leader.